Carly, you've been on a truly inspirational fitness journey so far. Thank Can you. Can you tell us a little bit about it, please? Yeah, sure. So I started about four years ago, 2014. I'd been big my entire life, um, you know, the obese child, chubby teenager. And then as I got into my late 20s, 2014, I was here in the UK and I woke up one morning and literally felt paralysed. I was, could not move, my whole body felt dead. And what, what had happened? I'd literally had a trapped nerve from the sheer mass of being 280 pounds, so 127 kilos. And it was that moment for me that was my trigger. So ironically, I actually started cycling in my lounge oh, really? room. Yeah. So watching TV, I yeah. lost four stone in about four to five months. Four stone? Yeah, just from literally wow. cycling 15, 20 minutes a day, going up to 30 minutes a day, 40 That's minutes. Amazing. And as I started that sort of journey of cycling at home, I started seeing some weight coming off and I was like, oh, oh, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it was that point after sort of doing cycling at home for a few months, I was like, I need more. And I went up to my local Pure Gym and I thought, yeah, this is good. This is my next step for me. And, and what, aside from losing the weight and the, the, the physical feeling of improving your health, what other benefits did you get from, from exercising? <laughs> it literally has changed my life. I ended up losing 10 stone in two years. And, but for me, it was how I felt. It was the way my life's changed, how I have a passion for being the best I can be. I think a lot of people think losing weight is easy, mm -hmm. but if it was, obesity wouldn't be one of the worst health problems in the world, sure. and everyone would be slim and thin. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but so for me, I wanted to sort of change the mentality behind weight loss and getting healthy. You've written a book, haven't you? To try yeah. and tell your story and to try and encourage others. So, a few years ago, people started saying to me, oh, you should write your journey. And I'm like, why? I'm just some girl losing weight. <laughs> but I think for people, it was that I was your average 30-year-old. I was working a full-time job. I was, you know, life responsibilities. Mm -hmm. So I decided to write basically a full autobiography of my life, of how I got so big, how I lost the weight, you know, going to the gym, that, I could do it, and then also the aftermath of maintaining the healthy life, still going up to Pure Gym every day, still yeah. eating well, that I could really still maintain that lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And to any woman or man that says, I can't do it, I can't lose weight, but you can, and all you need is you.